conditions, although it will still stay quite windy as we go through the next 24 hours. But at least today we had some sunshine out there. It was fine and it was dry for much of the day with some sunny skies. But around the coast we have seen some flooding. That's because those stormy seas have been combined with some high tides. Now, as we go through overnight tonight and into tomorrow, we'll see a few showers around. But for the majority, it will be another dry day with some sunny spells. Still on the breezy side and the air is pretty chilly as well and to the north of us it's been cold enough for a little bit of snow but for us we're still talking about some rain. This was the latest radar picture from around lunchtime today. You can see how we did see a few showers moving through the, during the afternoon and just in the last couple of hours there is quite a cluster of showers just sitting to the north of us. So I'm expecting these to move their way through during the next couple of hours. So we will see some heavier downpours for a time. But then the majority of the night then turns dry with some clear spells. Those showers become fairly isolated and into the early hours we'll see temperatures of 2 to 3 degrees. As far as those winds are concerned, they're gusting to around 40 to 50 miles an hour. Now it will stay windy through the day on Tuesday. Most places dry with some sunshine possibly the odd isolated shower but most places will miss them still quite chilly particularly when you add on the strength of that westerly breeze with temperatures at seven to eight now lighter winds then as we head in towards wednesday temperatures again on the chilly side first thing in the morning at around two to three degrees but then by day some sunshine for the morning it should stay dry into the afternoon but we just start to pick up a little bit more cloud from the west so that sunshine turning increasingly hazy later on in the day with temperatures very similar at around eight or nine degrees lighter winds on wednesday things a little calmer for a time but then as we head in towards thursday we see this air of low pressure bringing more wet and windy weather friday not looking too bad again perhaps a ridge of high pressure quietening things down but you can start to see out in the atlantic more low pressure systems so potentially another wet and windy weekend to come but in the short term it is going to be dry with some sunshine still quite blustery out there and feeling chilly with those daytime temperatures around eight or nine degrees but at least turning slightly milder as we head towards the end of the week okay did i see some sleet in some of those showers <laughs>